Yes, people ass! It's Saladin, and I'm back for a new reaction, a new Grey's Anatomy reaction, finally, because, you know, last week, I mean, a few weeks ago, I mean, the last episode I couldn't make a react, I mean, I could, but I wasn't satisfied with my reaction. But we're back, bitches! It's amazing! Blah, 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 blah! I don't know what happens in this episode, but apparently there's some kind of fight between Meredith and her new boyfriend. This is exciting, let's go! Bum, bum, bum! All right, all right, all right, all right. That's sad, man. It is. 16th century, a father son team made a groundbreaking discovery. We're leaving in 20 minutes. Oh, oh, oh! And apparently, there is some kind of, you know, love story between Joe and. Um, what's his name? Well, him. Uh, you know, so that's very intriguing. Crystal clear that nothing is just. He's got it. You forgot your wife's latte. Oh my god, she's finally bad! For Christ's sake, what happened to her? The sun. Too much sun. Hey, Bailey. They moved our booth. Oh, that's right. She's already hilarious. Wait, there was a medical convention? Oh, I love these. But you know, when they leave the hospital to go somewhere else, it's always very exciting. Well, she doesn't win the Nobel Prize for whatever the hell she's doing out there. I might just fire her. <laughs> I, I, and why on earth is Dr. Ndugu? Make this surgery happen ASAP or I'm pulling the plug. On the project? On you. You're gonna have to do some miracles, Marius. But we know you can do it. And where is that? Where the hell is Karasik? If Karasik came back for only one episode, I'm gonna get very angry. Actually, I already am angry. But they're so cute. Both parents. It's nice to meet you. It's an honor to work with you. At least someone thinks so. Maybe I just pulled the plug on myself. Mary, go back to the. Oh. Jeremy? No, darling, that's not normal. Oh my God. <laughs> this is hilarious because it looks like, you know, those beginning of appear of episodes of like NCIS or 911. We rarely see that on Grace. It's fun. Ooh. Like worked out. My mom, I argue with you. It's well, nice to see like Grace go into a more research thing, you know, like seriously movies. going into it. Because I want it to be like my brother. Very interesting. We never see that on TV, my brains. <gasps> you just became my favorite person. <laughs> well, you became my least favorite person. How do you not know? Excuse Derek me. fucking Shepard, darling. How? Excuse me. The one and only. Huh? And you're going to tell me you don't know Mark Sloan after that? Huh? Jesus Christ. What's happening? I don't think I understood what happened, but... It was very weird. What happened? <laughs> Wait, I'm gonna have to rewatch. I didn't understand. Okay. It became my brother. So who's your brother? Derek fucking Shepard, you bitch! You just became my favorite person. Right? That's, that's cute. That's that's great, right? Like, what's wrong? Still 79%. What Excuse that, me. What? What? Still 79%? Okay. But so... Autoclave room, right? <gasps> Okay, so she's just frustrated by the research. Okay, everything's fine. I thought that something happened with Amelia, but no, 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 okay. Okay, okay. I mean, they're just, sorry, sorry, they're just. Damn it, you must have turned the SFA. I'm gonna try to pack it. No, but that man is dying, my friends. He doesn't seem like it's working what you're doing. There is just more blood. I can help it. She's so cute! I do wonder what, why Maggie was absent from so many episodes. Maybe the, the actress was playing something else, another show, I don't know. 
If you know, please tell me in the comments. I'm really curious. President gets their own patient and their own OR. Seem to be into it. Of course they are. It's the future of teaching. Yes, the Weber method, the only method that works, my friend. Peer to peer communication can be very effective. Yes, it can. Oh, our personalized tote bags ready at Newport Med. Thank you. This is an acceptable. You're the worst students ever, ever. I mean. The greatest surgeons of this country went to Grace Sloan, Meredith Gray, Mark Sloan, Derek Shepard, Kali uh, Torres, uh, Arizona Robbins, Joe Wilson, Mary, the, the Dr. Bailey, Dr. Weber. Anyone to go somewhere else? I don't understand that, my friends. I don't. Brian's my donor. You've been my best friend since we were five years old, and you saved my life by giving me a kidney. Step out. Meredith, I'm fine. No, me. you're not. Listen to Meredith Grey. She knows what she's doing. Come on. And, you know, they teased in the promo that they would get angry at each other, but I think, actually, they won't, because they're great doctors. They know what they're doing, and they know. I mean... They both know that this is the right thing to do, so they won't get mad at each other. I hope at least, because if they do get mad at each other, I'll be very angry. Oh, Altman! I like her. Bucky! I like her too. We don't see lots of the characters in this episode, like... It's great that we're focused on Meredith, uh, Bailey and Joe, but... Uh, I would love a little more of the rest of the cast. Yeah, of course she can! Then I watched every one of her surgical videos that I could find. There's one of this Whipple. When she did the mucosal and anastomosis Of course, we don't see enough fans of Bailey and Weber, let me tell you that. I love Grey, but Bailey and Weber, they're gods. I mean, they're gods too. Should have given out weed gummies. That's actually not a bad idea. Stop it, it is a terrible idea. We never... Because your last sample is currently... at 92. Yes! You're dead, Ed, my friends! You started dating Paul. He was such a bad guy, I figured you needed a best friend. So here we are. Oh. Thank God, because I don't know what I'd be doing without you right now. Okay, um... What kind of but why are you sad like that? And then we can... It doesn't matter, it's home. fine right now. I mean, he's, he's happy to be your best friend. To be clear to the writers, my friend, to be very clear, these two are gonna remain best friends, not a couple, okay? <sighs> okay, that color, I mean, this green, horrible. <laughs> very horrible. Over and over, through the worst that humanity has to offer. Mm hmm. Don't they deserve to be happy? No, they do, they do. You guys deserve to be happy, and there's no right. doubt about that. Joe, you're right. But not with each other, like not a couple, okay? It doesn't have to be that. I love Meredith. Yeah, yeah. You? Ah, oh, 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 Go to her house and wait. Oh, I, I should, I should pick her up at the airport. Oh no, wait! Wait, 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 wait! wait. No, 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 no! Because now that he's told her, he had a crush on her. She felt the same. Oh, no, 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 no! But she doesn't deserve to suffer that much, for Christ's sake! And Amelia, oh my God, Amelia has them now. She's got them. No, 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 no. The group effort. <sighs> and the surgery is not the most complex part of it. You want to celebrate? Brunch and dinner? She does. A plane? plane? Oh, Alright, back to but back to I Seattle. A simple use of curved glass to bend and reflect. They're so life. falling in love with each other. <laughs> but. In many ways. But what about length? This is depressing, my friends. Do, uh, do you need something? I asked someone I would like you to meet. 
a student. And what hell of a student, my friend. Dr. Jordan Wright. He's a resident in Minnesota. <laughs> He's so he a fan of her. I love it. Sloan. We did a surgery together. Nice to meet you, Dr. Wright. Tell me why you're interested in Grace Sloan. You, Dr. Bailey. <laughs> I want to learn from you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm listening. <laughs> I love her so, so much. Nice this is why I watch Grey's Anatomy. And finally, some love. Lots of love for Bailey. I mean, this season, Bailey is on fire. Absolute full fire. <sighs> oh my god, my friend. Oh my god. This was such a cool episode! You know, it wasn't like a crazy episode, but it was a cute episode that makes you feel good about yourself, about the world, but lets you, you know, in the dark with what's gonna happen between Amelia, Link, uh, and everything. Uh, let's watch the promo for next week, my friend. The promo for next week, which is called It Came a Pound. Midnight Clear. All right, this is a very weird name, but I'm ready. I'm so ready. Let's go. There's an organ donor. The heart is a match for me. I want to put eyes on the heart myself. Oh, what's happening? Ah! What the hell? <laughs> I don't know what happened. What? The f oh, wait the f oh! oh no, 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 no. <laughs> no, <laughs> but please, 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 no more car accidents. I cannot handle any of this anymore. Oh, let's rewatch the promo. Let's rewatch. So, 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 all right, so they're gonna try to save Farouk, but why is she so sad? Okay, but so who's on the car? We have Hayes, we have. I need to know too. Oh my God. Well, um, let's die next week, my friend. Let's die just another time, you know. It's it's life. Uh, well, <laughs> anyway, so this episode was a crazy episode. Uh, I mean, not a crazy episode, but a really, really great one. Uh, and still uh, wondering how Meredith and Hayes are going to handle their relationship. Because I still think they would be great for each other. And we don't see them together anymore. So that's got me a little worrying. But, um, well, you know, Joe and Link's are going to be interesting. How Joe's going to handle everything. I do feel like she's, she might need to have some fun, you know. Maybe she's she hasn't been having enough fun enough fun you know, in terms of dating. Maybe she I don't think she needs to find the one like her love and everything, but she, just have some fun, you know. Because I feel like she's not very happy right now. Even though she's got Luna and that's all wonderful, I feel like she needs something else. Maybe or or a medical challenge, you know. She was supposed to have a medical challenge if Addison had stayed for the entire season, but she didn't. So. I'm wondering about that. Um, my Bailey, my baby, my queen. She's so cute. I love her so much. And this new doctor, Dr. Wright, I think. I'm going to love him. Actually, I love him already because the man's got taste. Let me tell you that. Compared to uh, uh, the person who doesn't even know who Derek Shepard is. Huh? Let me not talk about that. Uh, and so, yeah, really nice episode. And well, I'm gonna try to not die next week for episode 8 of season 18 of Grey's Anatomy, the winter finale. So, uh, thank you for watching. Love yourself. Love everyone else. And I'll see you soon, 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 soon.